In the thriving year of 15 CE, the Roman Empire owes its prosperity to the tireless dedication of legionaries like Servius Felix. A humble farmer's son, Servius traded his plough for a gladius and scutum eight years ago. Unlike many of his comrades he's a saver, not a gambler, hoarding his wages and even the three gold coins of his enlistment viaticum. Today he's part of a great march, a grueling trek of 30,000 Roman paces, almost 36 kilometers, all while bearing over 20 kilograms of armor and weaponry. After a day of relentless marching and camp building, sleep is fleeting, as Servius stands first watch, alert for any sign of danger. Dawn brings a meager breakfast and the camaraderie of his tent companions, a diverse band of brothers from across the empire. Their legion, one of four under the command of Germanicus, marches through the wild lands of Germania, their progress hindered by the lack of roads, forcing them to build causeways and bridges. Their destination lies on the outskirts of the Teutoburg Forest, a place of haunting memories for Servius. It was here, six years prior, that Germanic tribes ambushed and decimated three legions. Servius was one of the few survivors. The horrors of that day still linger in his dreams, but today, they return to pay respects to their fallen comrades burying them with full military honors.